Daily Devotion with Pastor Bala for September 8th, 2022 from John chapter 1. What was before the beginning? What was before the beginning? I will admit that's a strange title. But the gospel writer, St. John, was trying to make a very interesting point. So let's start with the Gospel of John, chapter 1, verse 1. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Okay, before anything existed, there was God. We need to remember this from the book of Genesis, chapter 1, verse 1. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. So before God started creating, there was absolutely nothing but God himself. So what was before the heavens and the earth? Answer, only God. So when John states that in the beginning was, which is a past tense, the word, and that word was God, John will tell us a little bit later on that the word of God is Jesus. Jesus is God before the creations of the heavens and the earth. We usually think of Jesus as being born of Mary, born in Bethlehem, and that is true. But it's better to think of Jesus as the eternal God who takes on human flesh and blood and is born of Mary. Verse 2, he was in the beginning with God. All things were made through him, and without him was not anything made that was made. So here, John is telling us that through Jesus, everything was made. So Jesus was actively part of the creation of the world. Typically, we think of God the Father as the creator. But we need to remember that there's one God. Yeah, there's three persons. We call this the Trinity. So all of God is doing the creating of the universe. Verse 4. In him was life, and that life was the light of men. John says of Jesus, in him was life. Well, if we understand Jesus as the creator of all life, then it does make sense. The hard part of this verse is actually the second part, which is the life was the light of men. John here is telling us that Jesus imparts life, and this life is more than just physical life. Consider this question. How are animals different from human beings? Both are created by God. But Jesus illuminates human hearts, people like you and me. There's a special spiritual connection between us and our Creator that is between humanity and the Almighty God. The animals do not have this this special relationship. Your dog or cat cannot say that Jesus is their Savior, nor can they understand a need for a Savior. This is unique for humanity. You may remember in the book of Genesis when God created Adam from Genesis chapter 2, verse 7. Then the Lord God formed the man of dust from the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life, and the man became a living creature. So God created humanity much differently than the rest of creation. God even even breathed into humanity the breath of life. This is that special spiritual connection and illumination that the gospel writer of St. John is writing about. So as Christians, we need to realize that humanity is the most important part of God's creation. God has a special connection with humanity that he doesn't have with the rest of his creation. So you are indeed very special. And we will find out later in the gospel of St. John that you have been redeemed by our savior, Jesus Christ. But for now, John is going to leave us with the idea that Jesus is the light for all humanity. God's peace and many blessings be with you. And thank you for listening. And please take an opportunity to share this message with others. 
If you have enjoyed these daily devotions, please consider making a donation to Peace Lutheran Church, 24024 West Main Street, Plainfield, Illinois, 60544. Thank you again for listening.